Hello, everyone, and welcome to Peace Day Live, brought to you by Peace One Day on this, the United Nations International Day of Peace, the 21st of September. Peace Day. I want to first start by saying thank you to our fantastic partners, the Office of the United Nations High Commissioner for Human Rights, Pathfinders for Peaceful, Just, and Inclusive Societies, United Nations Global Compact, SDG Action Campaign, and Peace Innovation Lab at Stanford. And thanks to our awareness partner, Twitter. Thanks to Digitalis, Social360, Signal AI, AWS, Green Lemon Company, and Hudson Sandler for their amazing support. And a special thanks to our trusted sponsors, Avon, Lipton, and Truvium Packaging. Today's show would not be possible without you. And thank you to everyone all around the world for joining us for what is going to be a fantastic show. Over the next nine hours, we'll be bringing you special performances by international artists, words of peace by leading actors from stage and screen, interviews with key advocates, panel discussions with thought leaders on the protection of people, the planet, and wildlife, as well as discussions focusing on the role of business, ESG, and the upcoming COP26. Please help us by sharing Peace Day Live as widely as you can, and do so using the hashtags that will appear on the screen throughout the broadcast. Now, to find out a little bit more about Peace One Day, Peace Day Live, and what we hope to achieve, let's watch a short film by Peace One Day's founder, filmmaker Jeremy Gilly. Humanity is at a turning point. We are already seeing the results of catastrophic climate change. Peoples are being displaced, finite resources are under even greater pressure, habitat and biodiversity loss is accelerating at an unprecedented pace, all of which increases the likelihood of conflict. Put simply, the climate action we take right now will determine how long we have left. If we want to live in a more peaceful and sustainable world, then we need to protect people, our planet and wildlife. At Peace One Day, we want to inform, inspire and engage a global audience with stories of hope. And Peace Day the 21st of September is now one of four opportunities each year to come together as one to address these critical issues. We now produce four live global digital experiences throughout the year at the turn of every season, encouraging dialogue and setting out action points towards a more just, equal, diverse, inclusive, peaceful and sustainable world. But that's not how it all started. My name's Jeremy Gilly. I'm an independent documentary filmmaker. In 1998, with a few committed friends, I began documenting my journey to establish the first ever annual day of global ceasefire and non-violence. For three years, I built the case for the day's creation. 20 years ago this year, in September 2001, UN member states unanimously adopted a day of ceasefire and non-violence on the UN International Day of Peace, fixed as the 21st of September, annually. It was originally brought to our attention by a UK-based organisation, Peace One Day. It is so decided. Next, I wanted to prove Peace Day could work in a conflict zone. In 2007, in Afghanistan, peace day agreements between all parties, including the Taliban, allowed 10,000 health workers to vaccinate 1.4 million children against polio on the day. And through awareness initiatives and strategic partnerships, over 1.4 billion people now know about Peace Day, with millions involved in peaceful action. Our new target is to make 3 billion aware by 2025. Welcome to the Peace One Day live global digital experience. Peace One Day responded creatively to the COVID-19 pandemic with the live global digital experience. 
And we're now focusing our activities on four interconnected calendar dates. 21 March, Anti-Racism Live. 21 June, Climate Action Live. 21 September, Peace Day Live. And 21 December, Space Transformers Live. Giving a voice to the young change makers working towards a more peaceful and sustainable world. For more information on this new direction for Peace One Day and to become part of all our live global digital experiences throughout the year, please visit peaceoneday.org and follow us on social media.